Hey guys, it's me Dory. Um, I've done the last two videos back to back, so I'm rolling right along with the last one here. With the Dusk Ball today. And, uh, I tried to save the best one for last, so hopefully I don't eat my words on that one and don't manage to get anything, but if you've seen the previous videos, I have... I have managed to pull a few things, so um, still ended up being worth it no matter what. Um, the only thing I've been a little disappointed on is that they've all been the same exact three packs um, and the same coin, so now I just have a huge stack of Volcanian coins now, um, but that's alright. Alright, are we going to get anything different? Same three. All right. Well, I guess this is for future reference if anybody looking to uh, purchase these. I would just assume if you're looking out for these, they would be a great buy because they're the only ones I've managed to get. So, and is the coin the same? Yep. All right. Well, I kind of wish it would have been Mewtwo or something else I would have preferred, but you know what? That's okay. Just have an extra stack of coins here. I just don't know where I'm going to put all these. Pokeballs here, because I don't really have room uh, in my spare room, because I have a I have a bookshelf that's got um, my Rayquaza, my Hidden Fates Rayquaza statue, and then I have a bunch of uh, when boxes used to contain the little uh, figures. Um, not many do that anymore. Most of the time, they're just pins now. Um, but I have like a shiny Darkrai one and. I think a QRM one and a Mega Gyarados one and stuff like that, and then a lot of pins and stuff. So, don't really have a lot of room. So I might just leave these on the table here, and they are nice to look at. So, I mean, they are pretty cool. And then um, I just have three more to look out for. Um, I don't think there's any more besides these five and the level ball and the other three that I need. Um, but it's, it's kind of weird, too, because when I was actually reading these up at work, they come up as spring 2021 tins. So I know these have been out for a while, but they must release them as different sets. So I don't know if maybe every single one of these tins contains these packs. Not really sure on that. Don't really know how that works. But like I said, if you're looking out for any of these packs, definitely get these because all five that I have opened so far have been these. So, um... When I got the level ball, I didn't really pay attention if it said spring 2021 on that either, but um, I know these have been released previously, so there must be some kind of different different set that they do for those that all the spring 2021 ones have all these Vulcan Canyon coins in the same packs, but that's all right. We have pulled a couple good things out of it, so I can't be too upset, so... You know, everybody's still looking out for Cosmic Eclipse and Ultra Prism, and I'm I'm missing so many cards from each of those sets, so it would have been nice to see those, but that's okay. I was going to get them regardless. Like, even if I would have bought one and been like, oh, these these are the packs that, that come with them. Oh my gosh, I can't open them. Um, I didn't even really look out a lot of times for when I got boxes like what packs can, uh, came in them. Unless I saw a bunch of evolutions because most of the time I was getting tired of seeing evolutions. I was like, ah, I don't really care about evolutions. But, um, but most of the time I really just bought the box uh, because of the promo or if it had a pin or something in it. I never really paid much attention to the packs themselves. So I guess now that I'm really back into collecting again, I should probably look out for that. But nowadays... Oh, well, there's there's the secret rare card. I actually already have this one, but uh, I hope that wasn't the rare. I don't know. I don't know where secret rare cards go in the set, but um, I kind of lost track with what I was saying. I got distracted by that. Uh, I'm blanking here. I don't know what I was saying. Oh, um... I was talking about the boxes, looking out for what packs come in, come in the boxes, but nowadays you'll be lucky to even find any, so it's like, eh, I'll take what I can get. Ooh, reverse hollow Charizard there. I don't, 
I don't actually remember if I have that or not. I know for sure if I do, I don't have the hollow, but that's all right. And Gyarados. I actually do have this card. Strange story about it. Um, My boyfriend's dad apparently found it somewhere. So it's like really beat up and in bad condition. And I was like, I know for sure that this isn't my card because I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have had this card so beat up. So I don't know what happened with that. So being able to get a, get one in good condition is, uh, is okay in my book. Cause yeah, I have no idea where he found that card. I was like, I mean, I'll take it. It's not in the best condition. It just had a lot of dirt and stuff all over it, but, um, not too bad. Not too bad for the last pack here. So, Okay. There's our sun and moon here. I know I probably kind of ramble a lot. I'm not really sure if there's... Well, not really sure if there's anything in particular to talk about. Um, but I just kind of talk about what's on my mind here. So hope you guys don't mind that. I feel like it would be just boring if I just sat here and... Kind of just flip through these. But, uh, that's all right. Oh, Hollow Alolan Muck. I don't actually believe I have this one, so. All right, two for two here. All right. Very last pack of this set. I don't have anything else to open for now, so. I can't really say this will be the last thing for a while, because I always say that, and then I end up buying something else, but my main goal is to get a Hidden Fates ETB or hidden the Hidden Fates 10s. I, weren't, I wasn't originally going to go for those, but... I've, I've been doing so well with Shining Fates, I'm like, oh, I didn't, I didn't do too much for Hidden Fates, but my work hasn't really gotten any, and I'm not, I'm not gonna do this, this whole wake up at three in the morning to get in line for Target on Fridays, because that's just, that's just doing too much. I, I mean, I, I can be patient. I'm doing my best to be patient, because I'm, I'm still waiting on that Champion Path ETB, but you know, there's only so much you can do, and I just, I've been spending a lot recently on what I can get, so, and I was patient with the Crobat box at my work. I finally was able to get one, and we've, we've slowly been getting a couple more in, so, um, I've said it in a previous video, and I'll say it again. Patience is key. I mean, if you, if you want to stand out at Target at three in the morning and, and hope for the best, go ahead, but, oh, that's nice. But I just feel so bad for the people that are, like, legitimately out there trying to collect stuff. And and you see the... There's our rare for the set. You see the scalpers and stuff. I see them at work. Like, I, I, hate, I hate to try to be, like, judgmental or anything. But, I mean, there are people that will call and then be like, Oh, uh, do you guys have any cards in? Because, surprisingly, our cards don't sell out there, uh, super fast until everybody tells their friends. And then all of a sudden, parents and stuff are coming in and grabbing everything they can. And... Um, our store actually has one limit per, uh, per item, but I mean, you can just tell they come up, they come in groups and, um, recently we just had some that we hadn't gotten out yet. And this guy had a handful of stuff and he still proceeded to ask, you guys got any boxes you guys got, you know, and you know, I, I grabbed a couple of these and I was just like, this is all I want, you know, and it shouldn't be such a challenge for people to go out and find uh, find what they're looking for. And it's it's pretty upsetting. Like, it, I feel like the reprint is already in progress. Um, because we have been getting a lot more product than usual. But it... I, I just feel so bad. I just feel so bad for people that are, like, legitimately trying to, you know, get get cards just at regular prices, you know, and every, at scalpers, you just can't, you can't let them win. It just, it just takes patience. Just be patient. <laughs> uh, so that is what I have gotten from all of the, uh, Pokeball tins. I've kind of got a little bit of a mess here, but 
uh, there's the Pokeballs that I've gotten recently, so yeah. So until I find the other three um, Pokeballs, that'll be it for now. Um, uh, and that's pretty much about it. Um, not really sure what else to say. I will see you guys hopefully in the next video, and thanks for watching.